Some of the features of this press include setting a minimum and maximum threshold value for a good part, bad part. First thing I'll cycle is a press with no part. It will add zero load to the part because there's no part present. The screen will represent a failed part and require interaction from the operator. If there's a good part present, the press will cycle, present the force, and retract automatically. The amount of time that the press stays down is set by the dwell timer. Setting the dwell timer on the force monitoring unit, press the up arrow, hit select, you get a highlighted square box, move the cursor keys to the digit you wish to change, hit select again, you get an underscore, up and down arrow changes the value, hit OK when you accept it, hit escape when you're done. At any time, the press is going down. If the operator takes their hands off the two-hand controller, the press will auto-retract. The only time the press will stay down is when the tool is closed. Then the operator can take their hands off and the dwell timer will, will count down for the appropriate time. If at any time the operator uh, hits the two-hand controller and there's a, an e-stop event, the operator can Hit the e-stop button and the press will automatically retract regardless of the dwell timer setting. Setting the lower and upper limits to the force monitoring unit. The first thing you do is set your password screen. The user password is user level 1. Hit enter. Password is 1. Scroll down till you get to the limit screen. Hit enter. Lower limit one. Set point. Set the value with the up and down arrows for the lower limit. And the L2 is your upper limit. Set the value for that with the up and down arrows. When complete, hit reset, and it stores the upper and lower values. When you cycle the press, again with no part, it reads no force and it's failed. When you put a part in the press and it reads a good part, the timer will time out and the press, press will retract as a good part. And if there's a bad part, both the lower and upper limits get latched. The computer knows it's a bad part. 